Welcome to today's 3D print. I got a treat for you guys. I actually matched this time. It's camouflage. You can't see it. Well, you should all recognize that. That is Luby's latest creation. She made a Christmas bauble. I guess that's what they call Christmas ornaments over there. Although I think bauble actually comes from sewing. And people started hanging them on trees. I don't know. I got to actually look that up. But, but I, for some reason, I remember reading that in my history. I'm a history glutton. I love reading about history. I don't know a lot about it. You're not going to ask me too many questions. But I love reading historical stuff. So weird facts like that tend to stick here. So I made the baubles. And here they are. This prints as 11 pieces. So the body prints as a two-piece for the top because it's hollow with threads. So you can actually put something in it. Uh, fill it up, make it heavier, put something in it, you know, put a, some scents in there or something like that, make it smell nice. I don't know, I mean, whatever you want to put in there. It's pretty cool. Um, put your stash in there. <laughs> but anyway, um, this is um, Filamentum's Vertical Galaxy with Filamentum's Vertical Gray and Polyalchemy Dark Pink. So you print, this is two pieces, you print the screw part and the cap, you glue them together and the body prints like this. It threads into place. So when you're done that together, here's one I printed in Shoon Plastics Orange. You can see here's the naked body. And you have the panels. You need eight panels since you, I tend to like double color panels, so that's four of each color. So here's two of the latest colors that I printed. Amaze 3D's transparent um, purple and Shun Plastics orange. And these are your panels. So this is going to be a new standard test print of mine. Whenever I see a plastic I like, I'll spit out a set of these panels and toss them in a box. So whenever I see a cool color combo I like, I can make a new body to match whatever panels I print and spit it out and make new models just every now and then whenever the fancy floats me. So that's the body without the panels. It threads together. So I did a whole bunch of them. because I really like these things. She makes beautiful stuff. I like printing them. This is the Polyalchemy Nightshade and Night Sky with a vertigo gray ornament body didn't come out the way I wanted. I wanted, I thought the vertical gray would be lighter. I'm used to seeing the vertical gray next to the galaxy, so it looks brighter. But when you put it next to another dark color, you realize that vertical galaxy is actually pretty dark. Rapunzel Silver would have been really nice with this. So there is that one. Very pretty. Then I said, oh yeah, I have to print a body in Night Sky. So this is a Polyalchemy Elixir Night Sky body with a vertical galaxy and Shun plastic transparent red panels. And then my favorite one to date, it is by far my favorite. My latest Maker Geek box came with some gold happens. So I did protopasta candy apple red with filamentum gold happens. And I believe this is protopasta um, glitter flake. I ordered that as a sample when I ordered the Candy Apple Red. The Candy Apple Red is stunning. So I realized I have to make some panels in the Candy Apple Red. So I made this next one using the Winter Blue. And it took me a while to figure out I needed another color that looked as nice as the Candy Apple Red and the Winter Blue, but wasn't dark. It needed to pop since the other colors were dark. And then I got the new Maker Box in, and it came with this recycled PET filament, and it was like perfect. I printed out a set of panels for with the PET, and it's beautiful. This combo is very nice. This is my second favorite. I really like that it showcases the candy apple red, and yet the blue winter blue still pops. That's one of my favorites. These two here are my favorites. I love these. They really stand out nice. So of course, you know what I do. <laughs> I make things big. And I also realize that I have a place to store these. 
So I had to do a cooperative effort. All of my competing brands had to work together. So first of all, I gave the big job to the ANA E12 since it was impressing me. It took 85 hours. And then the Tornado took 32 hours and the CR10 took 32 hours to print a set of panels each to make this. <laughs> Look how big that freaking thing is. This thing is so big, I can stuff my fist inside. Holiday Mega Man Blaster, anybody? <laughs> That's incredible. I also discovered that my left hand is quite a bit smaller than my right hand. My right hand has a tough time getting in here. I have to wiggle it to get it in there. My left hand slips right in. Look at the size of that thing. Oh, it's heavy too. I don't know how heavy this is, but it's... It's got almost a full kilogram of this transparent red um, shooting plastic in it. And then this is Zyro's transparent purple. And then this is um, E-Sun's transparent PLA blue. It is stunning. This is amazing. I would really be sad if I dropped this because I would not want to break this. But here's the cool part. I can also store all of my baubles in here. So they all get stored in here. You probably don't want to drop them in there. You don't want to damage them. But I got all of them in there and it's a third the way full so I can fit a lot of them in there. So now, throughout the year, all my baubles will store in the Mega Bobble. <laughs> oh, Luby, you make some very cool stuff. This thing is very cool. You can tell it was a little quick to put together um, when you designed it, but I love it. It's beautiful. I hope you keep making cool stuff available to the community. Start charging for it. I mean, come on, who wouldn't pay $2 for something that cool, especially once they get to know your stuff? You know, maybe make it free later, but there's plenty of people who will pay for this stuff. I know I would. If you put out anything that doesn't require supports and minimal infill that looks cool, I'll, I'll pay. <laughs> I don't mind. You make truly beautiful stuff and you deserve to be rewarded for it. That's it for today. You guys have a great day. Go download this off Thingiverse. The link will be down below in the description. Don't forget, anything you need will usually be in the description, including links to my profiles for my printers and whatnot. You guys have a great day.